And here we go. Uh huh. That's Jagged Alliance, indeed. So we get some good uh, pre game credits. So uh, we're gonna let that roll for a bit. Um, yeah, so I wanted to play this game because I haven't really played the first game. I really love the second one, but, uh, oh, game manual, Brenda Gano. She is known as Brenda Romero these days. So she wrote the manual of the game. This manual. This is actually one of the games I do have physically. Like the box, the biggie, the big box. Yeah. So that's cool. I like those. Um, Playhouse Studio. Yes, indeed. Okay, so that's the the small little intro. I think we get some more later on. Um, so yeah, this is Jagged Alliance. So my friend, my colleague, A, has made a... It's been a few years ago, but uh, she has made a Let's Play, sort of, of Jagged Alliance 2. And that's on our YouTube channel, and I really liked watching that. Um, it's been a while. It's also been a while since I last played Jagged Alliance 2, but uh, I like that game a whole lot. It's one of, you know, if I have like sort of the three games for the Desert Island, it would probably be Doom, Case of Cut, and Jack the Lines 2, maybe? I think I couldn't do three, I would need more, but uh, kind of like that. So I really like Jack the Lines 2. I've never really played Jack the Lines 1. I had a demo of the game back in the day, like when I was a kid, on some CD, like a magazine CD-ROM or something, there was a demo of the game and it had just one map, and I played that a lot. I played that over and over again. Um, but I never really got into the first game after I played so much of Jagged Lines 2. And the first game is kind of a weird game. It's kind of, it's one of these games where you kind of need a manual to understand what you need to be doing, because sort of the user experience is not exactly intuitive but once you know how it works it actually kind of makes sense so um in order to sort of get my bearings in the game i've played a little bit of this i've played like essentially the first day of the game that will make sense later once we get playing a little bit so i've played this just to sort of see how this works and how this game works and there's still a few things i don't quite understand yet but we're going to figure this out together. So uh, that's that. So most of this is going to be a first playthrough. Like I have not seen anything beyond sort of the first few sectors. Um, so let's start a new game and watch the intro. The image is just letterboxed that way, by the way. Uh, it will go full 4x3 later. Whoopsie daisy. Starts off with a bang, as they say. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> mm. Mm hmm. This is my daughter, Brenda. We're grateful to see you here. I'm going to make this as brief as possible. Mm -hmm. Lucas Santino has turned this island into our own private piece of hell. He was a member of Brenda's research team when the medical benefits of... Is the audio okay, by the way? It was a breakthrough that... I don't know. Broke thousands of Should be, but... But it presented the need for new research. The trees can only be found on this island. 
and to the best of our knowledge they okay i should turn that up a little there is not enough to supply everyone who needs the medicine oops Unfortunately, yeah. we can supply okay few. so i'm give it i'm gonna give it a bit more on determining a method of reproduction like that Four maybe ago, an extensive fire burned her research facilities to the ground okay all of my scientific All right, nice. and data were destroyed. I felt I was close, but without them, I was forced to start over. When we rebuilt, Lucas persuaded me that he should have his own facility on the other side of the island. He convinced my father that two independent research centers would have a better chance at reproducing the trees. I did it against my daughter's better judgment. It was a grave mistake. Within weeks, Santino had his own people on the island. Some of our employees were forcibly prevented from harvesting the fallow sap. Others have turned up dead. Now Santino has us pinned, and nobody can leave the compound. Mm -hmm. We must have access to the trees. Yes, we must return to business as usual. We need you to contact the same organization you spoke of. You must decide our course of action. All right, Hemingway. As many trees as possible are harvested until we regain control of this island. <laughs> okay. We'll pay you some of the money you'll need up front, and mm -hmm. the rest daily, based on the amount of sap the workers are able to harvest and process. It won't be easy. The island heat is brutal, and Lucas Santino is a very determined man. All right. Okay, that was the intro. Oh no, that is still the intro, sorry. Hmm. Ooh, that looks good. I have bad news, Dr. Santino. A helicopter has landed in the Richards compound. How many men? One. You are sure this... Yeah, should we kill him? No. Find out who he is. Then, kill him. <laughs> He's a villain. Also, that good ad lib music in the background. Okay, here we go. Ravenloft Stone Prophet. Yeah, that was kind of kind of the style at the point, right? For the cutscenes voicing. Yeah, there's a different like sort of the VGA graphics and um, sort of the hyper compressed voice acting and stuff. So basically, the story is. Um, oh, we're gonna see about that. So we are sort of a mercenary person someone who works with mercenaries and we're supposed to help these scientists that we've seen earlier um, regain control of this island that this guy named Luca Santino has seized because there is uh, a certain because that is kind of murky but um, I guess the nuclear explosion has caused the trees to mutate on the island and they produce a sap that has healing properties. And um, so we have the good scientists who want to use that to heal the sick children. Um, and we have the bad scientists who want to turn that into profit, I guess. Um, so that's essentially the story here. And we just come in and we are going to hire some mercenaries to regain control of the island. We're gonna play on normal difficulty um, because I don't know what I'm doing. So we're going to do that. And uh, here we go. So we have this nice diegetic menu here. Um, it's one of those games that does that. And I, I always like this. <laughs> uh, let's go here quickly because I think we need to do something. Yes, we're going to turn, we're going to turn the subtitles on. That's definitely not how radiation works, but uh, you know, you gotta... <laughs> so we're going to turn the subtitles on. The best thing about this menu, this options menu, is to close the options menu you do this. You pull the crank. Ah, and it's so good. It's incredible. I like this. Diegetic menus is a lost art in computer games. So, the first thing that we're going to have to do is we're going to hire some mercs. Some mercenaries. And, um, as I said, I've kind of played the first day of this, and I don't quite—I still don't quite know how this works. But I think at the end of the first day, I had sort of a daily income of about four thousand, four thousand money, dollars, I guess, 
So, I think... Oh, you're a merc, right. Ha! I didn't actually... Uh, yeah. I don't think we have kill sack here, unfortunately. So, um, we're gonna have to hire a few folks. And... Uh, Hey Kira, hi! So we're gonna have to hire a few folks and, um, you know, like, upon playing sort of the first day I have a few ideas about what we should do. I think we should stay around the 4000 mark so that we don't spend all of our money. I think you can maneuver yourself in a sticky situation otherwise. Um, so we shouldn't get too expensive, um, but we should also, you know, you can see there's some like who are very cheap and some who are way more expensive and we have to kind of uh, make do with that I think it was actually pretty tough to start out with but what we definitely so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get like one or two mercenaries who are actually good at shooting we definitely need that so we, we're gonna get w at least one or maybe two more expensive mercs like, we can't do anything like that. That's way too expensive. But I have one in mind. Let me just quickly see. Classic one. Also in Jagged Alliance 2. So we're gonna get this guy, probably. Ice Williams. He has a marksmanship of 86. And if you have, like... You kind of need that in this game to be actually hitting anything. So mercenaries with a low marksmanship, that just gets that just gets frustrating because they can't hit a barn door. Um, so ice may be a good choice. That's 1300. That's actually okay. And that gives us a guy who can shoot pretty well. We're gonna keep that in mind. Um Mike, wow. Twelve thousand. That's a lot. But he's very good. He's really good. Jesus, okay. Fox, Spike, Biff, Hurl. Fidel, I picked Fidel in my test run of the first day. And that, he is kind of an asshole. So we might not do that. Oh, Tex is on assignment. I think that is random. So we can't pick him. Bernie, here we go. Ivan Dolvich. We're going to pick that guy. He has a marksman, he's 1500, which is, for the start, that's pretty expensive. But he has a lot of health, he has decent wisdom. Wisdom, I think, determines how well they learn, how well they can improve their skills. He has some explosive skills, not much, but at least a little bit. And he has really good marksmanship for where he's at. And Ivan is just, yeah, the old reliable. Um, so... Uh, Whenever I play Jagged Alliance 2, I always wind up uh, picking Ivan. So, you know, that's just a... He's just kind of near and dear to my heart. So we're going to hire Ivan. Capitalist. Capitalist. Yeah, nice. He speaks only Russian in this game. In, in the second game, he speaks English. Which is interesting. So I think we're going to have um, Ivan and Ice as our sort of main shoot folks mercenaries. I think that will work. Sure, dude. I'm itching, I'm due, and I'm ready. They do. So um, these are going to be our main guys. So now we are at like, what are we at like, 2900 or something? 2800. Um, we don't need to, if you get slightly over 4,000, it should be okay. Um, let me see. Do we have, yeah, we have Grunty. Uh, Grunty is also, like, always one of my starting mercenaries that I pick in Jagged Alliance 2. So I think we're going to pick him here for old time's sake as well. He's not great. He's pretty cheap. He's under 500. He has a marksmanship of 69, which isn't... Great. But it's also not super bad. Uh, so, you know, he's just gonna be a guy that we have with us. That can do a few things. He can carry stuff. He can give us sort of some uh, fire support, you know. We can use him to flank some folks, maybe. Like, just having a third guy who can be in the mix is probably good. So we're going to hire Grunty. Helmut Grunter. Metavirian Madness! 
Count me in. And I just like Grunty. I don't know. Grunty is cool. So now we have these three. What we need um, for going on, we need someone who can give medical support. I'm thinking Beth. She is, a, she is at medical 44, but um, there aren't really any mercenaries as far as I can see in this game. Like, all the mercenaries that have higher medical skills are way more expensive. So I think it should be okay if we take Beth. I think there was also Hurl, I believe, that might be a choice. He has 44, is a bit cheaper. I think we're gonna go with Beth. Oh no, she's actually cheaper and has the same uh, the same medical skills. She has pretty high wisdom, so that's kind of nice. So, uh, you know what? We're gonna pick her. Yes! I'd gladly work for someone as Okay. Yeah. Um... I feel like sort of from what I did for the first day... You don't really... Like, stats don't increase a lot in this game, probably. We're gonna see how that works out in the long run. But we might have to... I think this is more a game of where you exchange mercenaries later on, rather than... Uh, rather than... Uh, just have your starting group and... Uh, just level them up. I, I guess. Tex, I also like Tex. He's a Japanese guy who is a cowboy, which is a is a good thing. Um, we need a mechanic too. So, let me see. Wally, Kaboom, Vinny. We might pick Vinny. He has mechanical 87 and 65. And this is all, he's very average, but he has very good mechanical skills. So we might pick him. There's also... I don't know, where is he? Oh, there's just so many. Snake Eyes Spec. So he has mechanical 99, which is very good, but he's completely useless otherwise. And I think the main problem here is that he has an agility of 51. So he has very few action points. He's extremely slow. Um, I might just go with Vinny right now. I think there's actually... We could probably do something like have a mechanic back at base camp and just stay there and repair everything after each day. Something like that. I think I'm going to go with Vinny. Like 87 is fine. Even if we... yeah. So mechanics, we need mechanics for maintaining weapons, so there's wear and tear on weapons, so we need to repair them so they don't jam in the middle of combat. And mechanics can also like pick locks and stuff like that, so that's going to be useful. I think there's going to be our starting team. Ivan, Ice, Grunty, Beth and Vinny. So that's cool. So we're, we have an $800 helicopter charge, we're going to pay that and we're going to be on our merry way. Okay. So, how about we save our game? This is my test save. Uh, stream one, whatever, like that, maybe. And uh, so we can take a look at our team. Here we go, current team. So we have expenses of 4,285, uh, which is okay. I think we can do, we can make do with that. We're gonna have, so the first day is actually gonna be us trying to find a way to make money, I guess. Um, so we don't run into any problems. Okay, so now we're gonna go to sleep. I'm gonna go to sleep. And uh, I really love these uh, little sequences, I don't know. We suffered a serious setback. Sometime this morning, someone managed to get into the processing plant and steal an essential piece of equipment. Mm -hmm. Without the micropurifier, we're shut down. We have to get it back as soon as possible. Until then, there's no point in tapping any trees. So I think the micro. So now we need to 
uh, you know, paid contractor who needs to look for money while at the job. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Um, so the first thing that we need to do now is uh, to find the micro purifier. As far as I know, I think I believe it might either be in the first sector we go to or like in one of these. It might be here, like in one of the early sectors it's going to be in that. So the first thing that we're going to do is we need to outfit our team. So let's take a look at this. So this is the inventory screen. This goes for kind of a realistic inventory, which is uh, that you have pockets, right? So we have a pocket in our trousers. We can put one thing here. This is kind of the quick swap slot, I believe. So I think swapping between these two is the least amount of... Uh, is the least amount of uh, action points that that takes. Like taking something out of your pocket actually, out of your vest pocket, costs more. So this is our main sort of inventory. It's determined by this assault vest that we that we are wearing. And there are different ones with different amounts of pockets, essentially. Um, and these are our, our equipment slot. So this is an attachment slot for the gun. So we can't just put stuff here, you know. Um, this is, I think, sort of uh, like Kevlar vests and armor, stuff like that. Helmet slot. There's Our this. In perfect condition. So, I don't know what exactly this does. I think it gives us the... So, I think with the radio we can give them orders. I don't know if it works if they don't have a radio. I don't know. And uh, this is a face thing. I don't know what that is. I haven't found an item for that yet. We're going to see what that is. We're going to find that out later. So that's good. Okay, so first of all, we need to outfit our mercenaries, right? So, uh, and I think we're just going to pick everything that we have here because I don't know if we can get this back. Or maybe on the next day, if you do the next mercenary outfitting things. We can do that, I don't know. I don't know how this exactly works, where that is. I just found if I didn't pick anything here, I wasn't able to get it in the first day. So, I don't know. We're gonna see. So we're gonna take some ammo. We might take a bit more ammo for you. So you need a vest. I think for you, for now, it's okay to t pick that. No, no, no. Oh no, I got rid of the knife permanently. What did I do? Oh no. Okay, so you can do things wrong. Uh, it's probably fine. It's probably fine. <laughs> it's probably fine. Okay, so Grunty, you need a vest. So you get that one too. You also get ammo. So you definitely need to outfit these three guys with ammo. Beth, you get this vest. And take these things. Vinny, you have no vest, but that's okay. Yeah, you can't take anything more than that. How about you pick this? You know, we're going to... Uh, this might just be our... I think that works. I think that works. It's fine. I destroyed that knife. Jesus. Okay. Oh. Now we're going to start in this sector. For now, we only have this sector. And we're just gonna go ahead, get to work. Destination Sector 60, here we go. And here we go, this is our starting location. And take a look at that, we are at this little compound here. Um, so, let me quickly do something like that, yes. So first of all, I think what I'm going to do is we're going to leave a bit of that on the ground. We don't need to lug that. I think it's going to be fine if we just have one stack of ammo for now. And what we're going to do now, essentially, is we're going to take a bit of a look around here. Because I think there's things that we can find here. Yes. Looks like there's something here. So that's, I believe, a key. I think we can just use that to open a door. I think one of the houses here is uh, is locked. 
Okay. Empty. Empty. There's nothing here. Mm hmm. Yeah, wash your hands, Grunty. Okay. So there's that. We have this little house here. Alright. It looks like there's something. Looks like there's something here. Okay. Alright. It looks like there's I think this is just a bunch of ammo for these revolvers. The thing is like these dingy revolvers, they are pretty bad. Um but we can't really do anything about that right now. So there's that. What do we have here? That's a helmet. Grunty already has a helmet. So right. let me just quickly so. check. Anybody without a helmet? Ice is without a helmet. So you take that helmet. So we're just going to do a little bit of additional outfitting here. The helmet is not great. We probably should have uh, Vinny repair that at some point. But for now it's okay. Yeah. Right. So, Grunty. I think this is the house that is closed. So, let's just quickly check this out. I really love this little animation. This is so good. It looks like this. Yeah. Okay, so this is another like toolkit. So if Vinny has used up his his toolkit. We can use that. I think we might also just use this here to deposit stuff. Um, and I think this is just the sort of the, the tree processing plant, kind of, I guess. Alright, and there's a few more things here. I think this is sort of the, the quarters for the guards or something. Looks like there's something here. Yeah, that's kind of the cool thing about this, right? Okay, so that, that's good. There's another assault vest here and another gun, but I think we're good with guns, but we definitely want this assault vest. It's a four pocket vest, so how about you pick that? We're going to carry this with us. Uh, and there's a knife. Okay, so Ice can get his knife back if he wants, but for now I think we're good without him having a knife. I haven't used a knife actually, so... Um, Vinny. So Grunty. You drop this off. You Vinny, you take that. Alright, and now we're good. So we're not going to have them carry any ammo. Uh, one thing that we can do, however, is we're going to drop off one of these health packs. We can pick that back up later. We're gonna use this. So if we can avoid it, we're not going to have them shoot anybody, essentially. Um, we're gonna try to keep these two out of trouble. So yeah. So I guess it's time to get going. Oops, not, that's the wrong thing, that's it. So you have to press the left key and the, uh, the left mouse button and then the right mouse button to move all of them, which is something that I didn't notice right away. I always move them one by one for the start of the game. This is really a game where you need to read the manual. Like, yeah, it's a good manual. Written by Brenda Romero. Okay, so here we are. So this is the first sector. Uh, we can take a little look at this. This is just sort of a little tree area. So we're going to try to kind of stay in cover and what we need... No, no, I uh, I ended the turn. Christ, oh yeah. I'm already doing fantastic here. It's fine. I think th they don't know that we are here, so they're not really doing anything. So we're going to leave Vinny and Beth over here. And um, you know what? Let's just have them look like this. And we're going to slowly make our way forwards with our guys here. Again, we're using Ivan and Ice as our main, as our main as our main folks, and we're just gonna slowly inch our way forwards here. School. 
Like this is kind of the this was kind of the cool thing about this game. I think it came out around the same time as XCOM. But this game has just a lot more like the original XCOM, you know? This game just has a lot more sort of personality to it. Like in XCOM every one of your of your folks is just sort of a generated person, right? And here you have like Like these are kind of people, and I like that. Cool. Yeah. No, they are, they went a lot further with that in Jagged Alliance too, but uh, already like this. Okay, they're not here. So there seems to be some random placement here because when I first played the game, I had some enemies uh, in here already. So let's see. I have a confirmed enemies. Okay, we got an interrupt, and there we go. There's this guy. Okay. What we're gonna do is we're going to move our folks down. We're gonna move Grunty back. The problem is that there's this large open area here. And uh, we can't really be in cover. Cover is a bit weird in this game, but um, yeah. Cool. So we're gonna move Ice in. I think there's no sense in trying to shoot him from here. We're just gonna hit the trees. But we're gonna try and move through sort of the forest down here. There's gonna be more folks around, so... We have to be careful. Right. Let's move Grunty down. They haven't noticed us yet, which is good. Yo. So what I'm going to do with Ice... We have 24 AP, which is good. Um, this is very close. We might be able to do this. Oh, enemy spotted. There's another one down here. Okay, we're gonna use Ivan to. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna stir the nest. Okay, that might have been a bad idea, but I think Ice is gonna be a way better shot than those guys. So we're just gonna hope. We're just gonna hope and pray. So you move in, and with Grunty, we're gonna go a bit lower. Okay, let's just hope that he doesn't get hit. Okay. Oh, we got an interrupt with Ivan, as he got the sideline there. So you're gonna shoot, right? Yeah. Ah, fuck, that was not good. Well... <laughs> so that's always how it works. In the first few... When I played this for the first time, I did the first like three sectors without being hit once. And obviously now that I'm that I'm streaming, uh, I am horrible. This is how that works. Okay. Um, so 16, that's going to be 8 left. That's not going to be enough. Okay. Oh no, 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 no. That was more... Oh, fuck me. Okay. Can we go through here? Oh no, we can only take this path. I did not do that well. I did not play this well. This is kind of horrible. Oh no, and now Ice is in full. Good thing is we get, did get a few hits in, so he has less action points, but uh, fewer action points, but this is not good. I did not do this well. Oh, fuck me. Let's fly it over here. Good! I am playing this horribly the moment I start streaming. That's how this is supposed to work. Come on. Ah. Okay, at least we got this guy out of the way. We definitely... Okay, Ivan. Oh no, I left him wide open. So you duck down. Right. 
Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. I'm taking so many hits. Good. Oh yeah, it's the streaming curse. I love it. I love it. Okay. Yeah, he's not great at shooting, but... Okay. Oh, that's nice. Duck down. Okay. Not good. Not good. That's not a great performance. Oh no, there's another guy up there. You know what? I might reload that save. <laughs> uh, you know what? We're just gonna do this. We're gonna restart the day. I'm very sorry about that, but uh, I know that I can do this better. Oh, I'm very hot. I'm sweating. It's a hot day. Okay, so let's do this again. Fantastic start. I know. I'm sorry. Uh, we're just going to quickly do this, so... Yeah. <laughs> okay, you take that. There's nothing over there. It's fine. So, Ice, you're going to take that helmet. I think this is deterministic. I think there's always going to be the same things here. Yeah. All right. Yeah, I mean, this is very much supposed to be a first playthrough, right? Like, I'm not... Uh, I'm not a pro at this game. But I haven't I really haven't played much of it. Okay. There's something there, indeed. So you take that assault vest. Alright. Alright, alright. Ice. No, not ice. Where is it? Vinny! Okay, so we're gonna drop this off. This is always, always a bit of a hassle in this game. Sort of the inventory management is a bit finicky, but uh, here we go. There's that. And now we're just gonna drop off a few of the things. Like that. Beth, you can drop off this. That is fine. Ice, if you're okay. You're okay. Alright. Okay. Good. Good, good, good. So let's try this again. Let's try this again. Again. Did the wrong thing. Come on, why doesn't this work now? Why can't I do all? Okay, now it works. Here we go. Here we go. Let's try this again. Sorry, I need to check something real fast. Okay. All right. Travel, tr tr travel west. Okay, we're gonna try it again. Um. So we have Ivan, Grunty, and Ice here. Oh yeah, okay. Ah, this is more like it was last time. Good, so we have some folks here. We're gonna go into cover. Keep some action points, so we can maybe get an interrupt. I might do something to get this guy's attention. If he can't see us right now. So how about you look over here, you look over here. Okay. If he doesn't see us, I'm going to... yeah. 
And it's just for that. Oop. Why? I don't know why that happened. I don't know. Okay. Bonus turn. Okay, so he hasn't... So we're just gonna position ourselves now. Okay, alright. Uh, you know what? You go here. This might actually be... Yes. So now they're definitely after us. So you go here. Oh, nice. Good. All right. Cool. There's definitely going to be more guys, so I might keep Ivan there to just pick folks off. You're not going to be able to shoot from here. No, oh, maybe let's try it. Ivan's pretty good. Yeah, Ivan's great. Okay. So that's the first guy dead. Don't know what that is. We're going to see. Oh, that's the micro purifier. That is already the micro purifier. So that's good. So we found that already. Okay. Let's be done. Let's see what happens. Nobody's coming. I feel like in this game, it's really just about moving forwards and finding the guys. Um, like, I think in Jagged Alliance 2, they are a bit more reactive about, like, when they hear stuff happening, that they come towards you and stuff like that. But, yeah. Okay. Let's move forward. These bushes are not great cover. But, yeah. And that's very good that we already picked off the first guy. Probably like four or five guys in here, so we're gonna see. Probably gonna be around here. Okay. Ivan, how about you move down? Okay, nobody here yet. Okay, let's be done. Let's be done. Ivan! So let's move over. Okay, we got a guy. We got a guy down there. Okay, okay. We can we can deal with that. So we're gonna move over to this sort of tree line here. of moving over there, you know? Let's see... Yeah. Opponent's turn. Okay, who are you seeing? Okay. There's at least two guys there. I might move Ivan over here to this area. Grunt is there. Ice is gonna probably stay here, kind of. Well, let's see. But he seems to be patrolling, kind of. Mm. Cool. So this guy is moving down. And there's the boxes. Come on. Okay. Um, grunty. Right. Mm. With ice, I need to get too close to actually make something work. Where's Grunty? Oh yeah, up there. Yeah, I should probably approach them from the north. He's walking down there, but that might be just a patrol kind of thing. Okay. 
I don't know if he's seeing me yet. Yo. Oh no, this is actually not. There's not. There's no way through here. So the next way through here is down here. And you know what? I'm gonna use ice to come sort of flank from the side. And we need to be careful about that guy. I'm probably going to try to get this guy's attention soon. Uh, but we need a bit more, a few more action points for that. You're gonna stay here. Okay, that's kind of cover here. Okay, let's try this. Oh, enemy spotted. Oh yeah, that's that. That's the patrol guy. That's okay. You need to be careful about that guy. Okay, now you're gonna stay here. We're gonna move in with ice once uh, that becomes a thing. Okay, you've not noticed us yet. So we're gonna move Ivan down. And we're gonna take off a shot. Nice, critical. All right, and now you're gonna duck down. Get a shot off. I'm gonna move back. Yo. Cool. Nice. Okay, good. Next one. Okay, I think that's a health kit or medipack or something. So you look. Ooh, okay. So there's a guy down here somewhere. We need to be careful about that. Uh, there's gonna be some more folks. Enemy spotted. Yeah, that's that's okay. We got an interrupt, but we don't have enough to do anything. Um, okay. Enemy spotted. Okay. All right. We're gonna stay back here. Ivan. We're gonna move over here. We're gonna bring Grunty down here. Oh, he's just... Okay, we got an interrupt. He's just continuing to patrol. He might... Nope, no, that's not working. Okay, that will definitely get his attention though. The enemies don't have grenades yet, so... Okay. Oh, you can't duck. Oh, that might not be good. Okay, he's going away. He's not happy about that. The thing yeah. is, there's probably gonna be more enemies still, right? I'm not happy about this tree. Okay, so we definitely need to be a bit careful about pursuing that guy. 15, you can get a shot off. That could be enough. Ah, uh, no, it's not enough. Definitely not. If you move down here, you can't. That's kind of the issue. That's not, that's a long shot. That's not gonna work, yeah. Okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Grenades are proper terror in this game. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> okay, let's be done. He's just walking away, huh? Problem is, I'm kind of afraid of just keeping the full because I don't know how many more guys there are. We're gonna see. Ice, ice boy. Where's Ivan? Oh, you're still up here, okay. I'm gonna do that, that, oh no, you don't have enough action points. That could actually work. It's a bit far away, but uh, hmm. he's just gonna keep going, huh? Oh yeah, nice. Good one, ice. All right, nice ice. And that's that. Okay, 
Still enemies left. Still enemies left. Okay, let me just quickly check the map. So we haven't checked all of this and this area. So we're gonna see. All right. Done with that. Good. Nice. You're gonna move down. I'm gonna keep moving you down. Uh huh. It might be this area, or it might be up there. If it's up there, I'm a bit worried for Grunty. We're gonna check this area first. Okay, no. I guess we're gonna start moving ice over too. Alright. It's cool. Alright. Ivan. Doesn't seem to be anybody around here. Yeah. Probably then to the north. We're gonna check that. Grunther. Okay. Not the greatest position, but uh, it's okay. There shouldn't also be that many folks left, I suppose. We're gonna see. Bushes. Ah, yeah, there we go. All right, good. Uh, gonna move you behind these trees. No, I'm not a fan of these bushes as cover. Okay, ice. I'm gonna get you over here too. Yeah, yeah, I think we should be able to make that work. And once he's engaged with you, we're gonna move Grunty up and... Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, you have noticed us, haven't you? Let's see whether we can do this. Oh, no. Yo. Cool. Yeah. Yeah? That's a bit too close for comfort. Uh, no. It's not gonna work. Let's see what he's doing. Oh, he moves away again. Doesn't like the odds, apparently. I wouldn't either. Okay. Can maybe actually... Yeah! Ice, come on. Don't shoot the bush right in front of you. What are you even doing? Okay, so you move up. I'm a bit too cocky here, but I think we should be able to. Yeah, he's just going away. Okay, this might actually also be the last one. I hope he is. I'm not sure. Can you get a shot off from there? Mm, that's a long shot. Nah, too much stuff in between. Okay. Grunty, you go there. Ivan. Oh, fuck it. Okay. Ah, he's still running away. I think it's just about. Okay, that could actually work. Oh, come on, Ivan. I know you can do it. I know you can do it. You're a good marksman. I know the guns are horrible, but... Yeah, he's hurt. 
Oh, yeah, buddy, you are in a... You are in for some trouble, man. Ah, oh, come on. No. Oh. Okay. Come on, Gunther, do it. Oh. Why are you all so terrible? More like Jagoff Alliance, am I right? Okay. Ice. Boom. Now. Now we're doing it. All right. Boom. All right, we did it. That's the first thing done. So we have an assault vest here, which is cool. It's a five pocket vest. Oh, that's awesome. So we're going to take this one. Let me see. Ice, what do you have? Inventory. You have a two pocket vest. Okay, good. So, Grunty, you put that down. And we're going to take that. We're going to leave the two pocket vest. And you know what? We might take the two pocket vest back. Don't need to leave things behind. Okay, cool. So now there's a bunch of things here. Uh, you know what? Let's just get everybody here. Because we're now going to open these boxes here. There's a Kevlar vest. Um, let me see. You don't have Kevlar. You don't have... What's this? Sun goggles. Sun goggles. I don't know if they actually do anything in this game. I don't know. Nobody has Kevlar, huh? Yeah. So, how about we... Ivan is kind of our MVP right now, so he's gonna get that. Alright. So you... What do we have here? A locksmith kit. Oh, that's something for Vinny. So you get that. Good. Oh, that's another vest. Four pocket vest. Okay, that is awesome. Because we can have Vinny get that. And now I think everybody should have good vests. Let me see quickly. So you have three. Ice. You have four. You have five. You have four. Uh, oops. No, you have three too, right? Yeah, it's okay. It's fine. We're gonna get better vests. Uh, I don't know what they do. I have no idea. The game is not very transparent about how these things work, which is okay. A wall probe. A wall probe in good condition. Okay, so we can listen to what's happening in houses, I guess. Don't quite know how that works yet, but I guess we're gonna find out at some point. Okay, and some ammo for a better weapon that we do not have yet. Beth, my friend, I think this is something for you. So you're gonna go and pick that up. And there's another box there. Okay. Empty. Empty, okay, there's nothing here. I think... That's actually kind of it. I think there weren't any additional boxes around. Might be here, but uh, I believe going through the rivers might be dangerous. So the one thing that we need to do now is we need to collect the micro purifier, which is around here. Awesome. Jack is going to be Yes indeed. S thirty six D nine stored S three Okay. I don't know what that is. We're going to drop that off back home. Alright. I think one of one of the things that has happened when I was playing 
the first day is I dropped off the micro purifier and then it didn't work. So I actually had to have this in my inventory at the end of the day. So we're going to keep that in Grunty's inventory. Still have that key. Didn't I go there? No, I don't know. Let's go east. And we're back. Alright, good. Let's move our folks back here. Alright, let's take a look at the map. So, we have two trees here, and we have... What is it? Seven trees here. So we definitely want to capture this. So what we might do for this first day is we're going to go here and we might take this one too. Like this one up here. I think there's like a house there and stuff, so that could be interesting. Okay, so we're going to drop off a few things. First of all, Grunty, you didn't go down there and there, right? I'm just going to open this to use up the key. Yeah. yeah. That's the toolbox. Oops. Did I get everybody down there? Yeah, I did. Okay. So now, let's drop this off. We might have use for that later. Or might just need to make a note of that. Sector 36D9. Stock AM. There might be something there. That might be. Let me just take a look. Sector 36. Yeah. You know, I'm just gonna make a screenshot of this. That might come into play later. Okay, we're gonna keep the micro purifier because of reasons. Okay, you have that. You have that. I think we're gonna find one of these weapons relatively soon. So we're just gonna fill our ammo back up. Ice mm, apparently took the most shots. Grunty, you still have all of that stuff. Okay. So, Beth, you're just gonna drop off one of these. Vinny, you're good. Ice. Can drop off that wall probe for now. Again, we're going to take this with us. And we're gonna drop off this. Because I think we're gonna find one of these weapons pretty soon. And you're also good. Alright. So. Let's move. Oop, let's move everybody up here. And now I'm going to do a little quick save, which we can do. So now I have a quick restore. Uh, we can only do this if we're not in a, an enemy sector, I believe. So yeah. So we're going to travel north and we're going to do the next map. All right. Good. Need to check something real quick. For some reason, for some goddamn reason, whenever I minimize the window, it gets stretched in OBS, so that looks weird, but... Okay. Alright. And we're gonna do it as we always do. We're gonna inch our way forward and try to spot our enemies. Gonna spread out a little bit, but not too much. Because we want to be able to concentrate fire a little bit. So that we, if we have like one enemy or something, that we can take them out quickly. Okay, there's a box there. Let's just quickly check what's in here. Oh, yeah, some more ammo. Yeah, you can take that if you want. Okay. Grunty. Let me move up. Let me just quickly check the map. Yeah. I'm expecting enemies to be mostly in this area. We need to be careful about this, maybe. So we're gonna have Grunty maybe take a look over there before we move on. Oop. Where is my... Key. Here we go. Ivan. Oh, 
хорошо. We're just gonna stay in cover for now. Okay. Grunta. Grunta. All right. Go there. I think there might not be much around here. We're gonna move Gr Grunty back again. Okay. Something. What's that? Looks like a rock. Well, maybe that's something specific. Well, we should pick that up, but we're gonna do that later. Ivan, okay. All right. And move ice over here. I might get Ivan to go here. I'm a bit disconcerted that we haven't seen any enemies yet. Okay, there we go. Okay, there's a guy there. I'm gonna stick in cover here. Okay. The other folks are probably gonna be around here somewhere, right? Hmm, or not. Granty, you're way too far south. Gonna move you up. Are they doing anything? Okay. Oh, there's another guy there. All right. We got an interrupt, but that's way too far away. I'm not gonna do anything. He seems to be moving around, though. I might get all of my guys here for now. Oh, opponent interrupts. Okay, he has seen me. Traverse location? Okay. He has seen me, but that's maybe good. Because maybe that's gonna get them down here. Oh, no, you get back down. Oh, uh, uh, uh. Ooh. I think he's just patrolling. I don't think he has noticed us yet. Yo. That's a bit too close for comfort. Let's see how much damage we can do. Come on, take another one. Yes, critical. You can't probably hit him from here. Nope. Nope. Shit. And Ice has zero action points. Yeah. Oh, I should not have taken that shot. That was a bit too risky. Yeah. Hmm. Grunther. That's too many action points to move him up. Right. I'm gonna try this. Oh, we're standing so close. Okay, good. All right. Did you drop anything that lo looks like a helmet too? Okay. A helmet for helmet. <laughs> I'm just doing the good jokes today. Okay. Let's see. You have a helmet, you have a helmet, you have a helmet. Okay, so it's not for helmet. Might be for somebody else. Beth. Yeah, you could use a helmet. Vinny. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So let's inch our way forwards again. Oh, Schweinhund, indeed. <laughs> ah, I like, I like, I like Grunty. He's so German. Okay. That shot did leave me on thin ice. Oh, that's a very good one. I see we are on the same wavelength. Okay, somebody's shooting at ice. 
cool. Yeah. Ivan, you're gonna move up here. And we're gonna stay behind these trees. They're already after us, so they might come towards us. No, they don't. Okay. <coughs> Let me just quickly check the map. Okay, there might be more folks over here. Then I have to be careful about that. I am gonna move Ivan up a little bit. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, there's someone up there. Okay, I can still go in here. I don't like this open area here. Grunty. Oh, he's way up there, okay. I might move him back. You know what? I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna move Ice back in this area. Might be a bad idea, but we're gonna see. So he just seems to be patrolling. Okay. Okay. Another enemy spotted, that's you, right. So you get in cover here. We don't have enough to go any further, okay. <laughs> At least now we know where this guy is. Ivan can't see him, but... Uh, yeah, I'm not a fan of the sideline towards Grunty here. I'm gonna move you here, maybe? Okay, I'm gonna see what this guy does. There's ice. Ice is here. Okay. Now you got an interrupt. It's way too far away, right? Yeah. I might take a shot just to get this guy to come towards me, but. Ah, you know what? Let's work with this guy first. He's just patrolling. Okay, that's alright. Got an interrupt for him now. I might take this shot. Oh, come on, Ivan. I know you can do better. Okay, that's the doorbell. I'm going to take that real fast. Uh, see you in a moment. Okay, there we go. Um, relearn German. <laughs> yeah. German, I think, is not the easiest language to learn. Because it has a bunch of idiosyncrasies, but... I mean... Ah, oh, come on, Ivan. Okay. Well, there's another guy there, huh? Oh yeah, I see you. Okay, let's bring Ice in a better position. Can you shoot him from here? Yes, you can. All right, that's good. Come on, do one. I need cover fire. Oh, your, your gun is jammed? What the hell? It's not even... Uh, oh, I don't like that. Okay. No, oh, come on, Ivan, do it. It's just too far away, huh? Okay, this might be a slightly more sticky situation here. Let me see. I might move Grunty up to here. This kind of leaves me open to this guy there, so I need to be careful about that, but... He's gonna see me once he moves down, huh? 
tripe. That might not have been a good idea. That might not have been a good idea. Especially now that ice is jammed. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, that leaves you open. Grunty. Yeah. Okay. We definitely need to reposition ourselves. Because this is not good. Okay. So you are shooting at me? Yeah. I need to move you back. Oh, come on. Okay, at least that's a hit. Oh, nice. Okay, good. Come on. Can, can you unjam your weapon? Shit. Okay. Okay. I don't like the jamming, and I don't know how to fix that. Whether he can do anything or not. Just has to try to take a few shots. Oh yeah, there we go, it's unjammed. Okay, good. If it wasn't for the guy up there... You know what, I'm going to... Oh, yeah, 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 it's okay. I'm going to get Ivan down here. With ice. So that we can focus... On... Those guys, and we're just gonna leave this guy up here? Yeah. Come towards us later. You know what? We're going to get all of our, all of our folks down here, and we're going to need to deal with those two. I think that's maybe good. Yeah, ice. Oh, no, don't shoot ice. I just want you to hunker down a bit. Okay, he's taking some damage. He's definitely bleeding. Oh. And you got a shot at Grunty. Nice. Nice. Okay, he's dead. He's wounded. Okay. Ivan. Ivan, Ivan, Ivan. Hmm. Let's take you over here for now. Get you in position. Okay, he's running away now. Don't like when they are running away. Okay, we can't get another shot off. Which is alright. Move you up. Grunty. Alright. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, fuck. Okay, I misjudged this. Okay, well, oh, that's just a just a flesh wound. We're okay. Alright, good. And some more ammo. Of this kind. So we still got that guy up here. So last we seen him, he was here, but he's probably moved. We're gonna see. Okay. He's gonna be okay for now. He's just taken a little bit of a hit. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna just start moving north and maybe see if we can sort of flank this guy. I could... yeah, there we go. Yeah. Could be more folks there. Grunty's not gonna be able to hit anything from there, no. But, yeah. So I need to sort of kind of cover this area, but this is pretty open. 
So I might move ice over here. Kind of. I don't know. Uh huh. Or maybe not. Let me see. Ice. Ice boy. Okay. Cool. Oop, no. Ah, shit, we can't. Yeah? All right. Eight, you can still hunker down, okay. Ivan. Oh, 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 Jesus. That's too close for comfort. But you've maneuvered yourself in a bad position when it comes to Ivan over there. Yo. Oh, yeah, you can't hit him, huh? <laughs> uh, it's directly in front of your face and you can't hit him. Cool. Okay, can take one more shot. Wounded. Yeah. Oh, Christ. This is just a bad position for Ice to be in. He's probably gonna take a shot. Shit, 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 shit. Well, now you're gonna move away. Okay, that's good. All right. Go here, this should be okay. Yes, all right. That's it. That's the second sector done. Done and in the books. All right. Okay, so we've got five clips of that now. There's this rock over here. I want to quickly check this. And Beth. Oh, this is just a rock, huh? Nothing underneath it or anything. Yeah, it's just, just a rock. <laughs> okay. So you pick this up, yeah, we need to repair that at some point. Let's have everybody move over here, and we're going to concern ourselves with those boxes. Okay, we can consolidate this. What do we have here? Three boxes. Okay. The rest we can drop off again. Alright. Alright, good. What's that? More ammo? Oh yeah. More ammo for that. We're gonna give that to Ivan. Because you might have some use for that too later. Empty. Okay. Cool. Cool. Hmm. Cold. And there we go. There's that cold. Um, it's a bit. We should probably repair this. No, we might give that to Vinny. And I don't actually know how the repairing works, by the way. Yo. 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 Hmm. Do we need to drop it off? Yo, 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 yo. I have no idea. Yo. Yo. I have no idea. Yo. Nah. Another full pocket vest. This is good because that gets us another inventory slot. What do you have? You have a three pocket vest, indeed. Okay. Kira, do you know how to repair stuff in this game? I might need to take a look at the manual otherwise.
Let me see. Um, maybe that's something that you do after after the day is done. A j yeah, Jagged Lines 2, I know where it, how it works in that game, but in this one, yeah, I don't know. That's fine. We're gonna we're gonna figure this out at some point. Uh, what we definitely need to do, Beth, you need right. to patch up Ivan. The day is about halfway done so far. This is sort of the the clock essentially. So we might do another sector. Always a downtime task. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna see. Let's patch Ivan up real fast, and then we're gonna. Yes. Okay. And now we're gonna move north. So we're gonna take one more sector, and oh shoot, and that's gonna be good for the day. Oh, you know what? Let's start this off right, I guess. Okay. Wow, that was a that was an early one. So let's take a look at this. Yeah, we have a house here. I remember this. So these were the three sectors that I did in my sort of preliminary research about this game. So we have a pretty thick jungle here, which we're going to sort of move slowly north to, through towards this house. And there's going to be a bunch of folks in there. So that's going to be interesting. That's going to be a different thing. Okay, that was a bit too far, but I got lucky. Okay. All right. Vinny. Okay, let's be done. Okay, what is this? Probably ammo, right? Yeah. We can just pick that up for now. Okay. And now we're gonna move our our main guys north. You seen something? No, that's just out of action points. Okay. That's a thick jungle here. Okay, you've seen somebody. Oh yeah, I see. Okay, where is... Ice, where are you? Yo. Okay, you're down here. Cool. Okay, that's gonna be interesting here. It's gonna be hard to spot folks and stuff, but... Let me spot it, and we got a good interrupt. Let's try this. Yeah, nice. Okay, shit. I think we are in better cover than he is, because we are directly behind the tree, and there's another one here. And you got an interrupt too. That's not a good shot, and we don't have the action points. Okay. Okay, that makes us see this guy again. That's a... Now, oh, I was... That's not gonna work. Too much stuff in between. Cool. There's also too much stuff in between here. We're just gonna hunker down for now. It's really hard to see where you can go and where you can't go in this. Ooh. Can you do this? Yeah. Yo. Cool. Okay, this is risky, but I'm going to take that risk. Yeah. All right. Good. Sometimes it pays off. I think that's a Kevlar vest over there. That's nice. So Ivan has Kevlar, right? Yes. Ice doesn't, right? Yeah. Okay. Yo. 
All right, let's pick this up. It's not in good condition, but it's not in horrible condition either. Kind of afraid of the house, I must say. There's a knife. Yeah, you can pick that up for now. It makes your inventory pretty full, but okay. Crasher, crasher. I don't know what... I shouldn't. I shouldn't say something in a language that I don't know. I have a confirmed enemy. enemy sighting. Okay, up there. All right. <laughs> yeah, that's probably what he says. Hi, Jack. I think that's what he says. Uh, that's kind of what he says when you hire him, right? Good, good. Okay. All right. Okay. Ah, I like Ivan. He's great. <laughs> okay, so... I'm gonna move my folks over here. We're probably going to take a, uh, a turn around the house. Because this is where we can enter. I believe this door is locked. We could lockpick this at some point. But yeah. Okay, Ivan. Ivan, you're gonna move over here. I think he's just on patrol. Yeah, he is. Okay, that's an interrupt, but we can't take a shot. Oh shit, that's way too close. Nope! Ooh. Crikey. Okay, Grunty. Now it's your time to shine. Oh, come on. I said shine. Okay, that's not gonna work. Uh, I'm gonna move my school back. Okay, another guy up there. Okay, that's fine. Okay. There's also gonna be folks in there, which is the main issue. Yeah, right? I mean, Grunty does not have great marksmanship, so... I guess that's to be expected. Ooh. You can move down, okay. Ooh. Luckily, he's also a terrible shot. Oh, come on. Okay, ice. It's a risky move. I'm gonna do it, though. Might need cover fire. Ah, oh, fuck me. Oh no, this is horrible. Oh, this is bad. Okay. Ivan, why is your gun so bad? Ice. Now you still have that one, so we should probably take this. Um, where's that guy? Yeah, you are there. Can you take this shot? Oh, yeah, you can. Mm. Mm. This is not good. I'm not in a good position here. Ah, yeah, I was expecting that. Yo. Cool. Yeah. Oh, finally, Grunty. Thank you. They're good. They're good. Okay. Very good is what he says. At least I understand him. Okay. Um... Okay, now that wasted a shot, but it's okay. I'm gonna move Beth up to patch up ice. All right. We're gonna do this in battle this time. Yeah. But so far, so far that worked out quite nicely. Okay, so we have some additional ammo there, but we're gonna pick that up later. Right. 
I'm just gonna stay in the forest for now. We're gonna do this, okay. Hmm. That's just a lot of room to cover here. A lot of area. I'm afraid that there might be folks at the windows. This is all bandaged, that is good. Oh. Beth, you're gonna move back. Because you're not good at shooting. Yo. School. School. Ivan. Okay. Good, good. Grunty. Let's get you up here. Man, I'm just enjoying this a lot right now. Ah, Jack, you know? Again, I think the game, like, I think Jagged Alliance really came into its own with two, but this is just fun. Okay, oh, wait, we're gonna pick this up right now. And move back. <laughs> okay, that was kind of, kind of a stupid thing, but my OCD had me do it. Okay. And we're gonna move north slowly through this. I have to be careful because there could be a lot of folks over here. There's definitely an enemy somewhere around here that was patrolling. Yeah. So yeah. I'm going to move Grunty over here just to check this area. It looks like this. Something there, okay. What is this? Oh, it's another revolver. It's arcade version Jagged Alliance. Yeah, it kind of is, right? It's a bit simpler, but it scratches a similar itch. See a dude over there, yes indeed. Okay, we're gonna duck behind this tree. We're gonna move Ivan over here. All right. There's a box there, okay. Grunty, you're gonna move north. Okay, I want to kind of check this area real fast, whether there's any additional enemies. And again, we're just going to move around the house, we're going to clear the area. Um, pathway, okay, I've heard about this game, but I haven't played it. Okay, this guy is moving into cover. Means, oh shit, you're directly... Yeah, okay, that was a bad move, my friend. That was a bad move. Well, that might be a grenade. That guy had a grenade. Okay, we got kind of lucky. Okay, that's some ammo. Okay. We definitely got lucky that he didn't get to use it. another one. Oh, that's nice. Okay. We can make use of that. I should probably not search this right now, <laughs> but I think as long as we've not been spotted, we should be okay. You have a four pocket vest, Ivan? You also have a four pocket vest, right? Yeah. Um, you know, we might give one to ice. Let me just quickly ch check this. What do we have here? Uh, some more ammo. I can pick this up, why don't you? Hmm. What do we have here? Oh, three clips of this. Okay, yeah. Kinda getting there. <laughs> just doing some 
looting and yes. inventory management right now. Okay. Anybody yeah. with a three left? You have a three, yeah? Right. Um, we're gonna do this after we're done. <laughs> Just need to keep in mind that we have an assault vest over there. Okay. All right, good. We're done here, we're gonna move over north. Ice. It's cool. It's cool. I like ice. I don't know. Ice is good. Okay. Why are you so slow, Grunter? Grunchy? Okay. So we're just gonna slowly make our way around the house. Um, there might be folks here. See if we can spot any enemies. So far we haven't. There's definitely gonna be folks in there, I believe. We're gonna see. I also did not quick save, by the way. You blame me? Hey! <laughs> Don't blame me for your questionable choices. <laughs> also, you don't need to eat the ice cream all at once, you know. can just uh, put it in the freezer and just eat a little bit each day. You know, the, the questionable life choice train has not yet left the station, is what I'm saying. You can still... You can still, um... Right. Yo. Cool. You can still get the coals out of the fire, except we're talking about ice, is what I'm saying. Cool. Okay. see okay there's some area here yeah we might have actually taken most folks out that are outside of the building cool. let's see yeah. Need to kind of check this area here it doesn't seem to be anybody around here yeah we would have spotted them already so it might be time to go Okay, yeah, it might be time to get in there. Cool. That's gonna be interesting. We're gonna have Grunty open the door. <laughs> That's why we have him, essentially. Yeah. Are you getting tired? Hmm. Okay, so the door is here. I'm gonna move you in position here. Move you down here. I should have kept some action points. Okay. Ooh, yeah, now we got the interrupt. Nice. Ice. Ice. Do, I, do we need to have a stern talking? Okay, can you move away? Oh, yeah. Okay, this is gonna get an interrupt, right? No, it's not. Uh, because we know where he is. Alright. That's that guy. I'm just gonna stay here and get another interrupt, yeah. Come on, Ice, what are you doing? What the hell, man? Oh, fuck. 
Yo. Cool. Enemy spotted, yeah. We're just gonna try to set up those interrupts. Critical, okay. Take another one. Alright. Yes, we did it! That's it! Wow. Yeah, that worked. Luckily, the enemies were quite stupid, so... Alright, let's loot this zone real fast. So... Because the, the day is not going on that much longer. Where is the, the assault vest? Right. So you're gonna pick this up. Yo. Vinny, you're gonna move up here because you might need to open a door because I believe there was a locked door in here somewhere. Okay, let's check this out. Yeah, you're gonna pick this up. Boom. Oops, no. Vinny, you're coming, good. Beth. Take this grenade. Take this grenade and move okay. over here. Alright. You've seen something? What is this? I think that might be a key, right? Yeah, that's a key for this door, if I remember correctly. Again. This is the last sector I've ever played in this game, so everything from now on is gonna be... Oh yeah, that's a health pack, right? Like a real health pack, like a, like a good one, the second tier. Medical kit, yes indeed. Okay, so you're gonna pick this up. Alright. Vinny, I need you to... Try to lockpick this door. Am I gonna do it? He's pretty good at mechanics, yes. Oh yeah, we got some boxes. What is this? Ooh, 9mm ammo, alright. Nothing. I think these are the only boxes that work. That's another Colt 45, nice. What? Gives me a break. Oh, I think we might need like a crowbar for that or something. Gives me a break. Oh, you're tired, aren't you? Okay. A combat knife. Uh. A nine millimeter. 9mm Beretta. Okay, ooh, that's even better. So maybe you're gonna take this. Um, Vinny... I'm gonna do some trading over here. We're gonna take these, you're gonna get that. So he's going to take that, yes indeed. Ice. We're gonna get the additional ammo. All right, we might switch eyes over to this gun. Well, at least I will. We'll need to repair that stuff. Okay, um, and I think we're good. I think we got everything. All right, it's time to go back to base. Time to go back to base. And then we're gonna end the day. We're gonna have the micro purifier and everything is gonna be good. We're gonna make a safe game and I might end the stream for today. I think that's a good spot to be done with it. Why is Vinny so tired? Oh, he doesn't seem to have a lot of stamina. Travel south. Right. 
All right, let's get everybody down here. It's going to take a bit, but that's okay. And yeah, we got three sectors on the first day, which is good. And uh, yeah, I'm probably going to continue playing this. Um, this is fun. JA1 is fun. Heard it here first, folks. Beth is already there. Oh, Vinny is slow. He's just... He's just not in a good spot. Yo! Yo! Yo. Travel south. And here we go. Everybody is back. So now... Yeah. Okay... Me? I think we're good. It's almost... <laughs> yeah. I think I, I think not either. Um, okay, what we're not, now going to do is we're going to compress time, and we're going to end the day. Here we go, end of day one. Ah, I love these sequences; they're really good. Okay, now we get sort of a little recap. I like this actually. Oh, this is good. Yeah. So we got three sectors, and now we can think about what we're going to do next. So we probably need to do some stuff about um, guarding those sectors. Definitely this one. This has a lot of trees on there. Um, I like that. Right? This really gives you sort of a sense of what you've been doing. You got the micro purifier and instilled some fear in the process. It's early, but with the plant back processing 20 trees tomorrow, we're off to a great start. Yeah. The urgency with which you retrieve the micro purifier warrants a bonus. Okay. I hope you'll accept a thousand dollars as a token of my appreciation. Yeah. I'll, I'll accept that. We have a, a rating of outstanding. I think we did well. After sort of the, the flubbed start, you know, where I had to reload, that was just just terrible. Um, I think this went quite all right. Okay. There we go. And, oh, Ivan got some additional wisdom. Ice improved his mark marksmanship. Grunty improved his marksmanship. That's good. And no, those guys did nothing. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Um, expenses. Natives, team, total. Natives is, I think, the, the guards. Well, apparently severely underpaid. Um, okay. Results, new balance, income... 500 per, tr per tree, yeah. Okay. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to save my game, stream one. And you know what? I think this is a very good spot to end this stream over now. So um, thanks everybody for watching. Thanks for hanging out in the chat. I'm going to be continuing playing Jagged Alliance 1. Definitely. Don't know if I'm going to do this today, or, uh, you know, I might still play some Caves of Kurt or some, something, I don't know. Uh, but we're gonna... This is definitely going to be a game that I'm going to pursue further. Again, I don't know if I'm going to do a full playthrough of this game, but I might just... I might just... So that's cool. Thanks everybody for hanging out. Thank you. I will definitely enjoy your I will enjoy your day and also mine. <laughs> uh, so you everybody who's watching, enjoy your day as well. And um, I hope you have a great time. Stay safe and be good. I don't know. <laughs> That sounded a bit more didactic than I wanted. Uh, okay. All right. That was fun. I've enjoyed this a lot.